Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another arena, to another portion of Bloodstained. Here we go. So, I know I said I wasn't going to just sit here and do this until I got it right. Simultaneously, you know, Im improved... Improved Scarlet Thrust, I gotta at least try, right? I don't know how far off I am from victory, but... And for what it's worth, I'm going, af I'm going after some of the enemies because it's still worth experience points, but I'm gonna try to ignore a good number of them just because I know that they take a good number of hits, and I would rather not have to spend all day just fighting one or two enemies. Alright, so now we just gotta try our best to take out Mr. Overlord. So get comfy, people. This might be the entire episode. I do think I have a, I have a method down, so take it for what it's worth. But yeah, it might be a little bit until I get it right. Hello, Mr. Giga.
Give me a sec. I'm just gonna try to avoid these guys for now. Oh, that didn't work. Stop it. This might almost be worthy of a redo, but I'm stuck. Oh, at last. Sustenance. Come on, Bloodless, we can do it. By the way, for those of you who have the game on Switch and are interested in trying this out, apparently the... Apparently this update is out on the Switch now, so... Just start a new game, enter the name Bloodless in all caps, and you're good to go. Stop it! this shit again. Monster, you're starting to get on my nerves. Alright, once I set my mind to something, I don't like to drop it until I've actually until I've succeeded. So apologies to you guys if this is getting a little old, but at the same time I want to get this done. Also, I want that in huh. Scarlet Thrust. Instead of making excuses, why don't we just give, give it an honest fitness try? And I'm guessing you're gonna jump at me. Alright, I made a good guess. Come on. 
trouble me. Funny thing is, I'm sure there's someone watching this going, Oh, he's just like me! Do this instead of that! Like, well, I mean, well, just know if you're perfect. Comment below and let me know what I'm doing wrong. As is, I'm perfectly happy to figure this out on my own, just like I did with Nightmare King Grimm and Hollow Knight. So let's not go pretending like like anyone here is holding it now. I'm just trying to get the job done. Stop it! Okay, I screwed up there. Must not have hit you with a charge shot. I keep forgetting that the charge shots have have that huge amount of knockback. Oh, at last. Now I know Scarlet Thrust can't actually hit this guy, so we're just gonna go at him with what with what moves I do have. Yeah. 
I don't think so. Scarlet Psycho. Scarlet Sometimes it doesn't. I curse the ground you walk on, 8-bit overlord. Not that walk is the right word because you don't have a walk snake. as much health as possible because I, in case you haven't noticed, I seem to be getting my ass kicked. Stop it. Okay, game. So far, so good. Just need to not screw up. Hold on, he's gonna... He's gonna do that. Ah, 
boxes. I wish there was more of a tell when he was just gonna like come flying in your face. Save our progress. Oops. And now we're going to look at the map, figure out where we're supposed to go from here. Alright, so there's a few places I could go, but I'm not sure where I could make progression. I suppose the best thing to do right now... Come back here. And go this way. Okay, that's a dead end. Come on guys, you're supposed to let me know when I'm going to a dead end. You remember when I was playing Hollow Knight? You should know by now that I have no sense of direction. That reminds me, I still need to go back and finish Hollow Knight. Even knowing that it was one of the series that I did that got like the least number of views, I still would like to finish it because I said I would. I could go. I believe that was water. I can't do water right now. Hmm. As embarrassing as this is, I'm having to admit that I have no idea where I'm going. <laughs> Link as to why Dominic is a playable character in Curse of the Moon 2 and 
her appearance here. Like, I don't really know if yeah. there's anything to that, I'm just curious. game, this entire thing was lined with spikes, and now there's no spikes to speak of, but now I don't know how to get, you know, further up. And obviously right here is where I want to do that. Makes me wonder, is there a spell that lets me create my umbrella platforms? You know, like she uses in her boss fight? Is there a way to take my face off? Like, my face off? Alright, well. I feel as though I've hit a dead end, but I also know that I haven't. Obviously some ways to go, because beating people wasn't the end. So it's kind of Yerman? Why? Why are you giving me problems? No, that's right, buddy. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> well, I feel silly now. How did I not? How did I not realize that that's what I had to do? Alright, so remember, once you get Blood Steel, you can get down here. Though why Bloodless was having trouble with that in the first place, I'll never know. Oh, really? This little hallway is about to make me upset. Goddamn bats and goddamn axe throwers. Ooh, there's a goddamn level up, goddammit. And this is the hallway that you run back and forth on with Miriam with, with the right setup to get the money. some sort of like coagulation power. It's like, no, I'm not just 
liquid blood? What are you talking about? I'm a, I'm a blood clot. That's right, I'm a tumor. I'm a tumor, I'm a tumor, I'm a tumor. Alright, that's enough of that. Thank you guys very much for watching. I am very much enjoying this, and now that I've solved a piece of the puzzle, I'm very anxious to get back into it and see what I can figure out from here. So, stay tuned for more Bloodless action, and of course, feel free to do the like, comment, subscribing, all that good stuff. Pardon me. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Apparently I have gas. I apologize. My name is Darksafe Walker, and I'm going to get some Pepto-Bismol.